Riemer Riemann reaction. Riemer Riemann reaction is a very very important naming reaction. Hi, hello, this is your lucky sir. Riemer Riemann reaction may what is the main product and what we are going to use? See, first we are taking here phenol, benzene with OH group is phenol, and you are using here chloroform. Chloroform, when treated with phenol in the presence of a base, it gives you salicyl aldehyde. This reaction is called Riemer Riemann reaction. Phenol, chloroform, base, salicyl aldehyde. Two important questions you need to remember here. One question hai, what is the intermediate here? That is dichlorocarbene. CCL2 is intermediate. And second question is, in this reaction, instead of chloroform, if CCL4 is used, base is mandatory. If this is used, salicyl aldehyde is the product when chloroform is used. When CCL4 is used, the product is salicylic acid. So two questions. One is intermediate CCL2, two electrons, dichlorocarbene. When CCL4 is used in place of chloroform, salicylic acid is the product. Phenol chloroform KOH. That is phenol when reacts with chloroform and KOH, salicyl aldehyde is formed. Phenol with CCL4 and KOH, salicylic acid is formed. Okay, very very important reaction. Both as well as you know, Riemer Riemann reaction. You get chloroform, you get phenol, you get aldehyde preparation, you get and exam you get also. Damn sure, this is very 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 important reaction. Chalo, good day.